Good morning, good evening, good afternoon, wherever you are. I hope you're having an amazing day. It is Tuesday, January 14, 2014. And yay, I figured out my camera problem. <laughs> Today, facts of the matter. Between stimulus and response, we have the opportunity to choose. Freedom of choice, how we love it. What we don't like is the responsibility that accompanies our choice, especially when the consequence of our choices takes us sideways, so we rationalize. I came from a dysfunctional family. My father never told me he loved me. The devil made me do it, Flip Wilson. Perhaps for too long we have indulged in this thing called liberty, making choices without bearing the responsibility of those choices. In the U.S., we have the Statue of Liberty on the East Coast. Maybe we need, maybe what we need is a Statue of Responsibility on the West Coast. We could all then choose to live somewhere between liberty and responsibility. Between stimulus and response, we have the opportunity to choose. Often when given choices, we choose poorly, as did the Jews when Christ offered them intimacy and protection. O oh, Jerusalem, Jerusalem, how often I wanted to gather your children together. The way a hen gathers her chicks under her wings, and you're, you were will, unwilling. Behold, your house is being left to you desolate. Matthew chapter 23, verse 37. O oh, Jerusalem, Jerusalem, thou that killest the prophets, and stone them which are sent unto thee, how often would I have gathered thy children together, even as a hen gathered her chicks under her wings, and ye would not. And then Matthew 23, verse 18. And whosoever shall swear by the altar, it is nothing. But whosoever sweareth by the gift that is upon it, he is guilty. Joshua, on the other hand, stands out as one who responded correctly in making the right choice. Choose for yourself today whom you will serve. But as for me and my house, we will serve the Lord. Joshua 24, chapter 24, verse 15. And if it seems evil unto you to serve the Lord, choose you this day whom ye will serve, whether the gods which your father served that were on the other side of the flood, or the gods of the Amor Amorites in whose land ye dwell. But as for me and my house, we will serve the Lord. Between stimulus and response, we have the opportunity to choose. We may not always be able to control the stimulus that confronts us, but we can choose the respond to respond correctly. Ultimately, the battlefield for our spiritual lives lives in the will. How and what we choose will reflect the very core of our secret life in God. And that's the facts of the matter for Tuesday, January 14, 2014. And this is something that you kind of, you know, got to think about on your own. What your choices have been. Peace be with you, my brothers and sisters. And may the Lord have mercy on us all. I love you guys. God bless.